person that will represent me in life or take a second wife to start having children so that in the process I get a son that will represent me. I have made up my mind. No, no, why are you talking like this? Eh? That you want to adopt another son or better still get another wife. Okay? Did I not give you a son? Is Onye Mechi or not your son? Who? Onye Mechi? This Onye Mechi. This one that is an imbecile. And then deaf and dumb on top of it. To come and represent me. <laughs> eh? Obak, why do you talk like this? Look, whether you like it or not, I will adopt a son. Now if I'm cool, if I'm cool, here. What is the matter with. Eh, eh, my brother is here. See, see what I call a son. What is it this morning? Eh? Uh, Nani, Biko. It's your brother, oh. I don't know what I have done to your brother. He said he wants to go and adopt another son or get another wife. Eh? Meaning you what? So what happened? Did I not give him a son? It's only if Mechi is not human being. Is he not my son and his son? Eh? So what happened? Because I told her I want to adopt a son or take a second wife. Who will give me children in the process, giving me a son, a living son, a living son that will represent me in life. Not not an imbecile. A living son. That's why she's running. Back. Uh, nine. Please. Eh? Reason with my brother. You know, as an African, he needs somebody to take after him when he is no more. And then. Uh, only Mechi here cannot do that. Hmm? Please, reason with him. Nani, no, no, I don't understand you. You know, as an African man, he needs somebody to take over from him when he's no more. And uh, only Mechi here cannot do that. No, no, Nani, I don't even understand what you're trying to say. Eh? Is only Mechi not human being? Is it not what he brought inside me that I gave back to him? Eh? No doubt about that. Eh? But don't misunderstand me. You see, Onye Mechi, as he is, he is not medically sound. You know it. He cannot represent this family. So please, for peace to reign, allow my brother to take another wife. I see. I have seen it. So you are the one supporting your brother in this evil. Okay? No problem. Uso Wadiro, two of you are now calling me a barren woman. After how many pregnancies? Bugonis, the worker. No problem. So bad wrong. We shall see. Come on, get up. We shall not see we anything. We shall see. We shall not see Come. anything, Obako. Don't worry. We shall, we shall not see, see anything. Anyhow you like it, eh? We will follow it. My brother will always support me in this matter. Sam, how are you, my son? Oh, see a son, see a son. Wake up, oh, wake up, oh, yeah, Hey, hey, what? What? Hey, hey, what? What is this? I don't know. You and your brother are continually giving my only son. Woman, woman. What do you mean? How can I kill my own son? He's not your son because he's dead. Leave my son alone. Leave my son alone. Oh, yeah, Betty. Hey. Oh, yeah, Betty. Hey. 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 Oh, hey. Hey. Hold yourself. Hold yourself. God, God knows why this happened. Yourself. Don't call God though. Don't call God because we are your brother know what you did to my son. Don't talk like this. How can I kill my own son? I know it's only a few days since the burial of your son. But I'll be traveling to the city tomorrow. So this must be discussed now. You see, with the death of uh, Onyemechi, it has become pertinent that you take another wife. 
Thank you very much, my brother. It's one of the reasons why I came to see you. Good. So you go home, talk it over with your wife, Obako. Make her see reasons with you. As far as these financial requirements, leave all that to me. Ah, truly, you're a brother indeed. I am proud to have you as my brother. That's all right. Just get the woman and leave the rest to me. I will do that without delay. <sighs> so, how is Ubaku taking the death of her, Oyemechi? He's very bitter. She's very, very bitter. But she will get over it. I believe so too. I believe so too. With time, she gets over it. Time heals us all wounds. Sorry, this your motto is very dust. Ah, my dear, Aye. if I tell you that Sam washed this car today, you won't believe it. He's the Oku. Dust is everywhere. Oh. Uh, Uba, eh? where is the thing you packaged for them? Oh, nine people. Sorry, I, I, I packaged those things so the day they were supposed to travel. When you told me that they are no longer traveling that day, I decided to sell them to solve one or two problems. Yeah, I didn't know they'll be traveling this soon. <laughs> uh, Angie, don't worry. Oh, I'll package another farm produce and we'll bill it to oh, you. Oh, it's okay, my co wife. But you don't need to bother yourself. All those things are in the city. Yeah. Okay, it's all right. Everybody in the car, we don't have time to waste. Okay. Um, Uzuroni, remember what I told you. Don't hesitate to call me if you need anything, okay? And remember, the gate. Lock the gate and keep the key as usual, okay? Ah, Sam, where is Mercy? Um, she went outside to get something. We'll just pick her up on our way. Take the wheels, please. Mm. Please. Just take care of yourself. Mm? Fast now. Ah. Uh -huh. Come, 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 hey. come, come, come. What is it? What, what was that thing you are telling my brother here? That you sold the things you personally bought, a, a package for my brother and his family. Yeah. Hey. What is your problem? No, is there any problem with that? Eh? Anyway, if you must know, I did not sell anything. Yes, there's no way I will share my things with an evil man. Not a, with a man that supports evil. No. Evil man? Yes. What makes him an evil man? Oh, oh, because you say you should allow me to get a second wife. Now he supports evil. That's what makes him evil. Obak. Where is your conscience? My conscience is in your stomach. Let's go.
to die. Oh, any improvement yet? No, 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 no. She has been like this. I think you should go and call the doctor. Okay, I'm coming. Be fast. Show me the way of life. I don't want to die. I want to What live. happened? Are you okay? Somebody Please calm down. They are okay. They are fine. Let me take you to them. Let's go. Let's go. Come, let's go. Nurses, please get the bed ready. Right. Okay. For the next patient. Come, come. Nanyu, what is it, eh? I what? just got Did somebody die? Uh, what? My brother Daniel. What is it? What happened? Did somebody die? I just got news that Daniel, my brother, and his family were involved in a ghastly motor accident. Hey! I, I said it. I said it. Hello. Eh? Evil men, you and your brother collaborated together and killed my son. Oh, where? Now look at it. I said it that the evil that we are doing this with them. I said it, my God is not asleep. Hey, God, I thank you. Oh, I thank you for answering my prayer very fast. Will you hey, shut up, woman? Hey. What has possessed you? I'm possess talking me. about the man that has been supporting you and me, my brother. And you are here. Happy that. Hey, hey, hey. This is just the beginning, though. This is just the beginning. All evil men, fire! All evil men, what a All evil men, fire! All evil men, what a This is just the beginning of Nani. Hey! Pain is too much. I don't think I can be it any longer. Please, my brother, do all you can and take care of my family. Please. What are you talking about? Please promise me. I, I, okay, I promise. I, I'll take care of them. But what are you talking about? What do you mean? Look, look my brother, you will be okay. When the doctor finishes his treatment, everything will be okay. Eh? You hear? Eh? Daniel. 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 What type of temptation is this? Eh? Where do I get money to bury my brother and his wife? And even Sam is still in coma. Hmm. Are you not a man? Eh? Whatever that comes to a man is equal to the man. Okay? Look, 
A man is a man when he can take care of his family. Not an ordinary retired school teacher like me. Nani, wait till. Are you not the one that told me that your brother asked you to sell his properties and then save them? Isn't it? He did not ask me to save, sell his properties. He said I should do everything within my power to save his family. Good! Which includes selling his properties. Eh? Or where, where is he expecting you to get huge amount of money? Come on, retired school teacher. That even your pension for one year plus now has not been paid. Am I not the one that has been feeding you? Eh? Hey, it's better we now begin to sell their lands. They have many lands. Let's start selling them off so that we raise money. Uh -uh. Yeah. But well, how can I begin to sell off his lands when his son Sam is still in coma? Hey, hey Giova. That one that is almost dead. Eh? Yeah. <laughs> Okay, please make use of your sixth sense. Oh? Mm. Oh. Mm -hmm. Sam, I've been calling you now. Are you back now? Who is this, please? I'm Joyce, Sam's fiance. Well, I am uh, Sam's uncle. Well, they, they were involved in a ghastly motor accident. And as we are talking, Sam is in a state of coma. You know, so, well, hello? 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 Hi. Dead. Who was that? It's Sam's fiance. Her name is Joy. Hey, Dad, why are you so cruel and wicked? I wonder what will be happening to that girl now. Hi. You know, even this guy told her that Sam is in coma. She just got off. But that should be the least of our worries. Yeah? We should concentrate more on how to sell those lands. Uh -uh. You're close, by. Good. When you get to that park, eh? Ask any cab to take you to St. Mary's Hospital. Exactly. Yes, yes. It's not difficult. Uh -huh. I'll be there waiting for you. Mm. All right. All right. It's a uh, joy. Uh, Sam's fiance. She's coming today. Coming to do what? What do you mean? I just told you that it's joy. Sam's fiance. She's coming to take care of Sam. Why you face other things? <laughs> <laughs> I hope she's not coming to poke nose into our family affairs. Eh? <laughs> to avoid her, I know no. No problem. Anyway. I'm off to the hospital. I'm going with you. Why? I need to go and see him now. I know how he's doing. Uh -uh. Is, is he not your brother's son? He's my nephew. Let's go. Uh -uh. Let's go because... Uh -uh. I need to see my... my, my, my. Mm, I don't want to die. I want to live. Somebody show me the way of life I don't want to die I want to live I have to see the doctor Let me see the doctor, I'll be back Cause I'm losing my life Yeah Somebody Hey, I'm losing my mind Some know <laughs> They killed my only son and expect theirs to live. <laughs> yeah. Diego, let us see how you survive this one.
don't want to die. I want to live. Somebody show me the way of life. I don't want to die. I want to live. Somebody help. Cause I'm losing my life. Yeah. Yeah. What happened? My mom, my dad. Where is Mercy? They are dead, though. Oh. All of you were involved in a ghastly motor accident. Ha. Mm. Mama, as we are talking, they are all lying in this hospital morgue. Auntie, what are you saying? I said they are dead. <laughs> What's wrong? Yeah? Auntie, I can't get up. What's wrong? I can't move. Uh, it's accident now. You have accident. I can't feel my legs. It's open. I can't. I can't move. Auntie, help me! I can't move. I can't move. I called your phone. Someone picked up and identified as your uncle. I asked about you and he said you, you had an accident on your way back. Okay. How did it happen? How? It's okay. It's not joy. You need to put yourself together, okay? Everything is under control. It's fine. Alright, what of mercy on your parents? Parents didn't make it. Oh my God! I see the other, and she she survived. I, but I'm yet to see her. Oh my God! So, who has been looking after you? My uncle and his wife. They visited earlier. <laughs> As you can see, <laughs> money is good. Yes, huh? yes. Uh -uh. Let us at least enjoy. Let us eat good food for the very first time. How about? Uh, uh. Uh -uh. You know, sometimes it looks as if I don't know how to cook because of everyday management. Just test and see. <laughs> uh. <laughs> How is it? Hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> you like it? Mm -hmm. Good. Uh, no, I want you to eat the chicken. Eat meat. Mm -hmm. Yes, I have plenty of it in the kitchen. Mm -hmm. oh. <laughs> Enjoy the meat. Mm. <laughs> Honeymoon. Mm -hmm. Hey. Uh -huh, so. Um. I go to the hospital first. Okay. Settle the hospital bills. Uh -huh. Then, um, if there's any other thing to do, I will do it. So after that, what next? Because um, I don't want you to continue the way you are. You cannot continue to be a retired school teacher for life. You need to start business. You need to start making money, so much money. money. Yeah? If possible, you get a chief fancy title. Uh -huh. Red cap chief. Yes. Yes. <laughs> mm. uh -uh. So, uh, mm. I want you to enjoy. Uncle. Mm -hmm. Which one is uncle? What is, what is it? it? Why, Why are you here? here? You're eating. Mm. Me too, I'm hungry. Will you shut up? Do I look like your house girl or your late mother? Eh? Are you stupid? So you're expecting me to cook for you? 
and say I would have cooked, but the store is locked. Uh -huh. So, I should give you the key to my store, right? So that you go and finish all my food stuff. I can get out of your store. Get out, allow my husband to eat. And you stop looking at her. Mm -hmm. yeah. Stop looking at her. Get out. Get out now. Please. Uncle. I don't want to die. I want to live. Somebody show me the way of life. I don't want to die. Um, Sam, I don't go see you. Welcome, Uncle. Mm -hmm. Sam, uh, how are you? Where is Mercy? You said you were going to come with her. Uh, I said I will come with her, but you know, I've been busy running around for the burial. Uh, Joy, I hope he has been feeding well. Yes, he is. I mean, he's brighter today. Alright, alright. Please, uh, I brought this one. Please okay. give this. Let me see the doctor. I'll be back. Uh, Sam, let me see the doctor. I'll be back. So. I don't want to die. I want to live. Somebody show me the way. Can you feel anything? You can't still feel anything. Don't worry, you'll be fine. Yuri! <gasps> You're welcome, sir. So good to see you. So good to see you. Um, Mr. Uh, Israel. Sam, how are you? Good for you. Good, sir. Um, please, Mr. Israel, can I see you outside? Uh -huh. Yes. All right. How have you been? So good to see you. So good to see you, too. Are you okay? I'm not really okay, no. What is it? Do you, Do you know Uncle and his wife moved into our house? house? Look, you don't have to bother your head about that, okay? It's just, they are family, I mean, so it's fine, it's fine. I don't know. It's not even just about that. I don't like the way Uncle's wife talks to me. She, she treats me like a slave. slave. Um, it's okay. It's just, um, for now, just, just, you know, endure. I'll be out of here soon. I know sort things out, okay? If okay. you say so, you always make everything seem okay. Everything will be fine. <laughs> How about Joy? Um, she stepped out to quickly get something. Very good news. Very good news. Sam is recovering very fast. Mm -hmm. He will soon be discharged. Really? Mm. Uh -huh. Well, we thank God. But I would like to see for myself. You're, you're not, you're not, you're sounding strange. Are you not happy? No, I am very, very happy. <laughs> just that I would like to see with my two eyes. I just want to see him. Uh, no problem. When I'm going tomorrow, you go with me. It's all right. I want to leave somebody. People are going to only two, two. But I took about five bottles. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Wonders will never end. Yeah. Ha! Ma Azuzo, you know you like talking in parables. <laughs> Please break it down. What do you mean wonders shall never end? 
Didn't you see how Zuronye buried his rich uh, brother like, like Fao? Oh, oh, oh. You noticed too? Uh -huh. <sighs> My brother. But there is nothing we can do. Eh? <clears throat> Why didn't I see the next song, Sam, at the burial? Hmm. That is another big problem. A very big problem. How could Ozuronye bury his brother without the son attending? Eh? I asked him, he said uh, his condition didn't permit him to be there. Eh? Ozo, it is very wrong of him to occupy that mansion <coughs> while his son, Sam, is still alive. You see? A boy old enough to impregnate a girl. Eh? Imagine! Uh -uh. What did he say, Adoriyama? My dear, cry as much as you can. It is your right. But don't forget to console yourself. And try and be strong. For your brother who is hospitalized, he needs you. Please be strong. Did did you see how they buried my parents? Like chickens? It's okay. God sees everything. He knows everything. Just be strong. Everything will be fine. Please. It's okay. Don't worry. I need to leave now. Um, sorry. Before you go, I I know I should have done this long time ago, but it's still not late. Now that my parents are no more, the house is too big for my brother and I. So I'm wondering. If it's possible for you to come live with us, I mean, just for the meantime. Okay. Really? Yes, of course. Thank, Thank you. you. I would really appreciate your company. No problem, Marco. Thank you. You're welcome. I need to leave now. Um. So I will talk to my brother to speak with your father okay thank you please be strong i need to thank leave you. now okay strong Uzuronye, how could you bury your own brother like common father despite all the lungs you and your wife sold how could you do such a wicked thing secondly what happened to his son sam why did you not bring him back from the hospital to pay his last respect? Wadiebo, who are you to question me? Huh? I'm happy for that last statement you made. Uh, that word you added in your statement, which says, your brother. Who are you to query me on how I buried my brother? Of course, I sold the land. I used the money uh, to treat the son, Sam. And it was the balance that I used to bury, the, bury my brother and his wife. Ozuronye, you are under a spell. Look at the rubbish you are saying. I have confirmed everything I've been hearing. The news is everywhere. Let me start going. But whosoever that is playing this drum that you are dancing. Mm -hmm. mm. Come, let me tell you what you The dead has been buried. And that is all that matters to me. Don't come to my house again. Mm. 
No problem. Don't go. No, 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 no. Sit down. Sit down there and continue to advise my husband on how he would have buried his late brother. An mafia. Stupid elder. Come on, get out of this place. How much did you even contribute? Did you contribute anything? And you're here dictating to him how, how he would have done it. Okay, get out. Zuzu out. Get out. Get out. Hmm? Get out. 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 Get Mm -hmm. Just don't mind him. Yeah, we still have more lands to sell. Uh -huh. ah. Yes. Doctor. Yes. You talked about disturbing me very soon. Does that mean I will remain in this wheelchair? No, I never said that. You only take time to heal. But I want to know, are we talking about days, weeks, months, years? Tell me something. Depends on how your body responds to treatment. Don't worry, you'll be fine, okay? I'll come check up on him later. You're going to be fine. I don't want to hear it. You're not the one in this wheelchair. Why? Why did this have to happen? Why? I am so sorry, Sam. But you need to relax, okay? You need to relax. Let the doctor do what she knows how to do. You don't understand how I feel. I couldn't even attend my own parents' funeral. It... Why is this happening to me? It's okay. I'm sorry. You'll be fine, okay? I'll be fine. Don't know. I don't know that. Just saying it. Hello, Kenneth. How's everything going? It's obvious you haven't heard the tragic news. We're all involved in a car accident and um, I lost both parents. Myself and Mercy barely escaped with our lives. As I speak to you right now, I'm talking to you in a wheelchair. But I'm on the phone right now talking to you, right? <laughs> by his grace, but you know what, um, let's leave that aside for now. Um, I need to know how's everything in PH? Um, you know what, um, it's fine. Once I'm strong enough for the long journey, myself and Mercy will head back and then we'll have a sit down and try to sort everything out, okay? You called me? Yes. Sit down. So, who did you say you are to Sam? I don't understand. What don't you understand? I said, who are you to Sam? Eh? How can a beautiful young girl like you leave your parents' house to come and stay with a sick boyfriend? Don't you have something good to do with your life? Eh? Ma, I'm, I'm Sam's fiancé and I should be by his side at this time. Besides, both families know about the relationship and they are good with it. <laughs> my dear, it's better you take my advice and leave. Find yourself a suitable and promising young man to settle down with. Unless you want to end your life pushing a sick boy on a wheelchair. Is that what you want to do for the rest of your life? Auntie, how can you say such a thing about your husband's nephew? Don't you wish him well? 
my dear, just take my advice and leave. Okay? That's what your father did. Your father ordered that I should do everything within my power to save you, to make sure that nothing wrong happens to you. And that's what I did. Uncle, did you just listen to yourself? So that led to you selling all my inheritance. Please tell me, how much was the hospital bill? How much did it cost you to put a burial ceremony together? Look, uh, 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 Sam, you, you should not actually be complaining, you know? You should be grateful that I saved you. I should be grateful that you saved me by selling all the property that I, I'm supposed to inherit. I should be grateful. Okay, tell me. Where is the balance? Because you cannot tell me that you exhausted all the funds all the proceeds from selling everything else to inherit on, on hospital bills and the burial ceremony. Balance? What balance? The money was not even enough. I, I, I had to sell this house. You had to sell what? This house! While myself and Mercy were still alive, you sold this house! Uncle, is something wrong with you? Now tell me, who did you sell this house to? Because I want to meet that person. I want to know that person in this community that bought, that bought this house from you. Well, the, the good news is that it, 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 it's still within the family. You know, I was asking myself, why would I let an outsider come and take my brother's things? So, my wife and myself put money together and bought it for ourselves. Uncle, you are so not serious. You are not a very serious person. Because if you are a serious human being, you will not be saying the things you are saying. You bought what house? With what savings? Tell me! With what savings, uncle? What is going on here? Why are you shouting, Sam? Auntie, your husband is a very wicked person. This man right here is a wicked man telling me that he sold this house. How dare you! <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. He, he just lied. Eh? He did not sell it to an outsider. We bought it ourselves. Eh? Both of you are in on this. This is a ploy to, to, to take all of my inheritance. Honey, please let us go inside. Eh? It's better you know the truth and live with it. Let's go inside, please. Get up. Get up, let's go inside now. Uh -uh. What, sort, what sort of wickedness is this? We helped you and you never want to, 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 be, to appreciate it. Let's go inside, Biko. What sort of wickedness? These, these people are wicked. Uncle, Uncle Zuri, he's wicked. I sold all my inheritance. Everything, our land. Claiming that this house now belongs to him. That he, he, he bought the house for himself. We, we overheard all they said. He said, Sam, you, you need to calm down, okay? These people, they are wicked. I'm speechless. I never knew. I never knew Uncle and his wife could be this evil. They are capable of anything. And that is why we can't stay here. We can't. We have to go back to the city and manage whatever father left us. Why are you lamenting like that? Eh? 
Are you the first person that has taken over the brother's inheritance? What is it? Paco, will you say that my brother did not die for us when he was alive? Moreover, what is the need to take over a big mansion like this when we do not have a child to inherit it? Is it not you and your brother that killed my only son? Eh? Hey, how have I allowed my soul to be used by you? How have I allowed my soul to be used by you? I, I was saying it don't. I was saying what, 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 what? Oh, calm down. Why are you shaking like a leaf? Are you not a man? This house belongs to us. Obako. My brother built a beautiful bungalow for us. Obako, let us go back to our house. Never. I can never go back to that house. <laughs> I can never go back to that house. Else, another one will happen. Oh, oh. What? Another one will happen. Don't back me. Which one happened before? Uh. Obak, what are you not telling me? Obak, what are you not telling me? Hey, am I under his spell? Hey! Mm, I don't want to die. I want to leave. Somebody show me the way of life. I don't want to die. I want to leave. Somebody help. Cause I'm losing my life. Yeah. <sighs> hey, I'm losing my I can't continue like this. I can't continue like this. I have to leave. I have to get myself joy and mess out of this place. I can't continue like this. Oh, wow. My uncle was never, he was never like this. He was not the type. Something must have happened. I also need to inform the elders. Yes, that's what I will do. Inform the elders. Um, myself and Mercy will be leaving this place for good. Never to return. Not caring for anything. Just abandoning it all. You're joking, right? No, I'm not. You can't do that, Sam. You can't possibly leave your inheritance. This is your father's house. You can't leave it and travel back to the city. You have no idea the kind of nightmares I've been having. If we don't leave this place soon, something terrible is going to happen. I feel it. You won't stay back to fight for what is right for the yours. There is no need. I mean, I have other things to fall back on and, you know, pick myself up again. The company in PH is still, you know, running. It'll do. All right. If, if you've made up your mind, then I'll just have to go back with you to the city. you can help me ask my uncle Zonia, and his wife here how they managed to buy my father's house. My son, we heard what you said and we appreciate it because it means that uh, you regard us as one family 
Um, I asked Uzuronye here where he is going to raise money to bury your parents. And he said, uh, your father permitted him to sell whatever he can sell to save his family. That was what he said. Exactly what he told me when I asked him. Mm -hmm. But what got me confused was the house. How can an ordinary retired school teacher, primary school, become a house owner overnight? And even a car owner. You sold all his father's properties, yet you buried them like fowls. No, no, what, what, what are you two talking about? Nobody. Eh? What are both of you talking about? We sold the properties according to his late father's instruction. And we used the money to save this ungrateful soul here. And then bury his parents. And he's here talking rubbish. Who? Oh. Second reason for this meeting. Myself and Mercy will be leaving very soon. Ah. Never to return again. Leave both of you in the hands of God. Kachuku go say no puchuku. Yes, Sam. It has not gotten to that level. You know? Uh, about the house. About the house what? Eh? We bought this house with our money. And none of you has the right to ask us how we bought it. It is none of your businesses. My son, calm down. We will look into this issue again. But for now, the most important thing is to relax and get well first. Other actions can follow later. Process. Uh, Mazi, I thank you for everything. Myself and my sister, Mercy, will be leaving for the city very soon. Um, this um, period, Mercy has gotten really fond of your daughter, Meso. In fact, they are now like sisters. Which is why I want to make this request, hoping you will grant it. We would like for Meso to come with us to the city. <laughs> anyway. uh, hey. uh, my son, I heard what you said. I heard what you said. Meso will be so delighted to hear this. All I know is that um, I will be there for you as a father whenever you need my assistance. Yes. Thank you very much, Mazi. I'm very grateful. Okay. Man, I was, I was shocked. I was really surprised the day you called me over the phone to tell me what happened. But anyways, we're glad you're alive. Why is this always happening to me? My hope of traveling outside this country to earn a second degree has just ended. I mean, look at Sam. He can't even walk anymore. Huh? Why me all the time? Why? Ken, you need to stop with the lamenting. I mean, I'm, I'm still here. I'm still alive. All the hope is not lost. And yes, I agree. The dream of, you know, both of us traveling together is gone, but I will make sure it doesn't affect you, okay? Oh, no, no, um, Sam, right now, my utmost concern is for you to get back on your feet. That's all that matters to me right now. Every other thing is secondary. I, I agree with Ken, Sam, okay? Let's forget about the whole traveling thing. You can always travel. For now, let's concentrate on you getting back on your feet. I'll be fine. Don't worry your head. I'll, I'll be on my feet very soon, I am sure. But now, I need to pick up where my father left off. The company must move forward. 
I'm sure in no time I'll be able to, you know, take care of things. All my loved ones, my sister and friends. Okay? Really, I'm sorry, bro. Yeah, it's fine. You know what? This <laughs> the atmosphere is too gloomy for my liking. It's just um, let's have some drinks. Ken, help us get something to drink. Yeah, get us some drinks. Let's um, right. let's drink the pain. Okay. You sure? The usual. Yeah, yeah, the usual, the usual. All right. You still love who? Hmm? The one on which year? Or which one? Better leave that guy and move on. You are a woman, no? Time wait for nobody. Mommy, how can you even say such a thing to me? You know the reason I am successful today is because of Sam. And at this point in his life, he definitely needs me. And so? Is he the first to help? Eh? So you owe your life to him. You know, sometimes when you talk, it's hard to believe that you're a Christian mother. Sam, the reason we stopped production and laid off some staff was because of lack of material. Within that period, I tried everything to communicate with your father. But your uncle told me that you and your parents had a fatal motor accident. May his gentle soul rest in peace. You know, it is okay. Um, right now, what needs to be done must be done. So, so I'd like to know, what would it take to get the company running at its full capacity again? We need to get the materials, service the engines, and we are good to go. Right now, the water factory is at its peak. Okay, um, I would like to know the exact cost of what it would take to get everything functioning properly again. Um, I'll head to the bank, my father's bank, um, and see how we can make things work. Okay, uh, once again, I accept my condolence. I promise you, I will never disappoint you or your father. That's a promise. I should be on my way now, Mr. Sam. Thank you. Um, ben, I would like you to know that I spoke with the manager first because um, I needed to know how well operatives at the company has been since my father's demise. Um, I would have come to you first, you know, being a staff, uh, knowing that I can get information from you, but I needed to speak with the manager first. It's, it's okay. It's okay, okay. As for the company, everything is moving fine, except for the few machines that need to be fixed. And yes, it's just the manager, myself, and one or two staffs that are left, so we would going to be needing more hands. Exactly what he said. But that won't be a problem. Um, things will be sorted out pretty soon. So, were you able to go to the bank? Oh, no. Um, I'll be doing that tomorrow. I still have another meeting with the manager. Um, okay. yeah, um, ben, um, I would need you to be more involved with the company's activities. And then you report back to me if need be. That's, that's not a problem. That's not a problem. So, where is uh, Mercy? I haven't seen her since I came. Um, she went to secure a jam form. She should be back in a bit. That reminds me. How about um, Felix, my father's driver? Felix has been fine, except that the dude has been unemployed since your father's passing. Yeah, it's been rough. Um, I won't be for long. I'll get him on the phone. I have something for him. Okay. I'll do that right away before I forget.
What is it? You're not eating. She don't like the food. I mean, what the doctor said. I might not be able to father a child. Might not be able to get a woman pregnant. Are you serious? Is it possible that you might not be able to? <sighs> what? Please do not say that out loud. Does she know? Not yet, but I would have to tell her at some point. No, 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 no. You can't do that. What do you mean? I mean the... No, 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 no. You can't do that. What are you going to tell her? Do you know how she's going to react to it? No, but... I always do have to tell her the truth. No, you don't. Not now. No. You don't tell a lady that kind of a thing. No, I, I'm not going to do that. I, I mean, I'm, I'm going to get Don't married you? to her. I'm building a family Don't with I her. I'm telling you this is a bad idea. Please, do not tell her. Please. You know what? Just let's continue eating. I'll, I'll figure something out. It's okay. Somebody help me. Hey, hey, I'm losing my mind. Don't know what to do. Somebody help me. Every day I'm going down. Still no solution. Somebody help me. Oh, I, somebody help me. Oh, I, I, somebody help me. Ken. You need to calm down, okay? Calm down. Give me a while to recover. Um, I would need to go over to my father's company to see how things are turning out. Come on, Sam. I understand how things are at the moment. And I see how much you're trying to be a man in these difficult times. I mean, nobody wants to be a liability, right? Joy. Thank you so much for standing by him at this difficult time. What I do for Sam is for humanity's sake. Besides, you know I love him. Yeah. I mean, humanity is a reason for all existence, isn't it? <laughs> Sam, I need to go home. You know I've been with you since. At least let my parents know that I'm fine. I've prepared some food for you. When your sister comes back, she's going to serve you. Thank you so much. You're welcome. You have done more than enough for me. I'm really, really grateful. Uh, you know what? Um, you can, you know, take one of the cars. I don't want you, you know, jumping from one vehicle to another. Really? Mm -hmm. oh, thank you. <laughs> All right, I'm going to talk to you later. All right. All right. You know, women, just a little piece of magic and they show you the best side of them. <laughs> anyway, Sam, I will have to be taking my leave now, okay? All right, um, not to worry. Like I said earlier, I'll have to stop by my father's company, you know, see the way production is turning out. In no time, I should be able to finance the trip. I'll be forever indebted to you, man. Forever grateful. Thank you very much. I. You soon. Yeah. Enough with the pity looks already, okay? Oh. Heaven knows best. These things happen for a reason. But I am positive um, everything will add up for good in the end. I want both of you to 
put heads together to see to it that the company runs smoothly and is back at its best again. I'm counting on both of you. I mean, yes, I'm the new MD, but considering my condition and the fact that I'll be running things from home, I may not be as effective as I would like to be. So I need people I can trust. So I'm counting on both of you to make things happen in my absence. Chai. Chai. Obanko, you have killed me. You have finished me. You have turned me away from my brother's children. <laughs> They don't even call me anymore. When I call them, they don't pick. Whether they are alive or dead, I do not know. Eh? Ubaku, you are a bad wife. Do you know you are an ingrate? So upon all the things I did for you, upon all the support I gave to you, this is the way you want to pay me back. By calling me names, right? <laughs> no problem. I don't blame you. I regret ever getting married to a weakling of a husband like you. Obako. Obako. That's my name. Call me that name several times. I don't care. Eh? Wait, oh, are your brother's children better than my son that you and your brother killed? Eh? So you can go to hell for all I care. I don't give a damn. That is rubbish. Of all the things I did for you, this is the way you're paying me back. Rubbish. Nonsense. Just look at the mansion and make sure that you're living in. And you're here calling me Ubako, Ubako. To hell with that your name. Nonsense. Nonsense. Hey. Hey, hey, hey. Oh. Finished. Finished. Somebody help me. Hey. Somebody help me. Hey, I'm losing my mind. Don't know what to do. Somebody help me. Every day I'm going down Still no solution Somebody help me oh, I, Somebody help me oh, Somebody help me Somebody help me I don't want to die I want to live Nem, you have done well Okuye njakbogo yini nem you behave like me. Huh? God forbid that, that uh, he will cage you just in the name of marriage. Maka get it one. Ma, being crippled is not even the problem. It's him knowing that he can't be able to have a child and then hiding it away from me. You see it? That is the wickedness of men. Huh? See, he wants to cage you as if you are the cause of his predicament. That one is not my business. All I know is that I have left him for good. Hmm. Mana, that car. See, you are going to sell off the car and use it and start something. How, mom? Please, oh, it's not possible. I can't sell it. I have to be driving that car. Hey. Hi, bro. You look worried. What's going on? Yes. Can I see? I'm sure you understand 
I can no longer keep up with the relationship. Take care of yourself. Bye. What? Choices. Mercy, you just have to be strong for your brother Sam. Considering his condition, about the properties your uncle and the wife sold, I will ask you not to get worried about it. Because I know you recover all. Trust me. <sighs> Thank you so much. Honestly, Stella, you're a wonderful friend. And I want to ask you for a favor. What favor? Can I invite you to the house? Why not? At least to be with Sam. I know he's in a wheelchair, but I also know that God will heal him. You know I've loved your brother so much, but he's in love with another. And the another has abandoned him. Please do come around. Please. It's okay. I will. Thank God you didn't. I would have done some garbage to bring you back to life. <laughs> <laughs> wow. It's been a while this beautiful smile crossed your face. Stella, thank you so much. Okay. <laughs> You're right, Mercy. You're right. Stella, thank you. Thank you for bringing laughter into this home again. Only I had known. It's okay. I'm here now. <laughs> Thanks to your sister. <laughs> Enough of all this. Let me take you out for a walk. Okay. <laughs> Have fun, bro. Yeah. <laughs> oh, That beautiful lady. Is she Sam's girlfriend? The girl with him now. Why do you ask? Nothing, I'm just asking. 
Well, um, she used to like my brother. But then my brother's attention was on Joy. Until Joy showed her true colors. So here we are. <laughs> and you're right about her. Because girls are deceitful. Yes. Am I sensing some jealousy? Uh, no, I'm, I'm just saying. We're family. Okay. Kenneth, I'm happy about your admission into Wilkinson's University in America. I'm really, really happy about it. You and Mercy will be traveling together to study. She's all I've got. I need you to please take good care of her, like a brother. Oh, Sam, you are such a wonderful guy. I mean, I thought you forgot me already. I mean, I didn't know you still have me in mind. I really, truly appreciate this. And as for Mercy, yes, I will take care of her. In fact, she's my priority now. <laughs> Sam, you are my second dad. <laughs> <laughs> no, I love you so much. Yes. <laughs> You're a great love. man. <laughs> but I don't want to leave you alone. I mean, it's fine. I'm good. I mean, I'm strong enough. I'm vibrant enough. But I'll be fine. Are you sure? 100. Um, I'll be sending money for upkeep to both your accounts. Wow. <laughs> Sam, I'm really grateful. Thank you so much. God bless you for me. You're welcome. Enough of all this. Um, well, get us something to drink. Okay. What would you like? Oh, well, well, soft. Alright, soft. Alright, I'll be right back. Okay. <laughs> Stella, you are like a sister to me. Hmm? Promise me you're going to look after Sam. You know, when I'm gone, you will be the only one he has. <laughs> so promise me that when I come back, I'm going to meet the two of you together. Why not? Of course. <laughs> you don't have to worry about that, Mercy. You can testify that your brother Sam is relaxed around me, <laughs> right? Don't worry, there will be changes before you return. I trust you. I promise. Thank you. I miss you. I'm, I'm going to miss you. you. I'm missing you already. I miss you. <laughs> be focused, okay? Of course. Meso, what is it? Come on, I'm going to miss you too. I'm just going to study. It's not as if I'm going forever. <laughs> I'm going to miss you. I know, I know, and I will miss you too. Yeah, hmm? I know you still Ah, but Stella is around now, I'm so here. it doesn't matter. <laughs> it's good. It's no time. <laughs> Thank you. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. You work here. Wow, we miss you.
Yes, sir. Hmm. Thank you. <laughs> hmm. So, how is she? What did you tell me about her the other time? I don't care about her. She's there. I don't talk to her in school. How oh, that's her. Hey. Sam! <laughs> You can walk now! Yes, I can! Wow! Thank you, Jesus. Mercy, we hear this. No, 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 no. We're keeping this a secret for now. So we keep it a secret. I want to see the look on her face when she sees me like this. Meso, you heard me, right? Okay, I promise. <laughs> I'm so happy! <laughs> so, wow! This is this is shocking. <laughs> Thank God. It's amazing. You can work now. Yeah. Um. You. I don't know. I don't know how you do it since you came into my life. Everything has changed. You're like you're my chi. Who are you? My love, you've said it all. I'm your chi. Why not just keep quiet and let everything unfold by themselves? This is just amazing. Like we... Well, <laughs> have a drink. No, no, no I, I just, I just want to take this in. Oh, God, thank you. <laughs> wow, thank Listen, God. I need, I, I need to, you know. Stretch my legs around the compound. Yes, yes. Ah, uh, so, you understand? Like, I'll be going out with you. What is this? What's going on? Hey, somebody help! Somebody help! Walk. Hey! So somebody help! Somebody help me! Happen, but let's just be good. I've never seen this face before. Why is she trying to kill me?
Who is this woman? Why did I see her in my dream? And why did I want to kill her? I've never experienced such before. Yes, Uncle. In the flesh, sir. Yeah. Sam? Shh. Who is she? Please, please forgive me. I'm sorry. Please, please. I'm truly sorry. Nani, please help me. I beg her. Forgive me, oh. I'm sorry. Don't kill me. I am the one that killed his parents. And, and I also used to for my husband. To make him take away everything that belongs to him. Nico, please don't kill me. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Nani, please. I'm sorry. Don't kill me. Don't, don't kill me. Oh, don't kill me. I'm sorry. Oh, I'm sorry. Hey, I'm sorry. That's my uncle's wife. My uncle, Zoye. It was him and his wife that took everything from us. Mm. All my father's property. I've seen that woman before. Yes, in my dream. We had an encounter. And since then, I've been asking myself why. Because I know I've never met her before. Sam, please forgive me. You can see I was not walking. You had it. You had it. I was not walking with my senses. Please, please. Ask, ask for the house. Please take back what belongs to you. I'm going back to my house. I really don't care for anything right now. Yes, I am here to claim what's rightfully mine. And as for you and your wife, I leave both of you in the hands of God. I need to talk to her. I need to know why she did all that she did. Yes. Your brother is a wonderful man. Oh, thanks to you, Mercy. <laughs> what am I missing? This one you're singing praises about my brother. <laughs> anyway, my brother told me that both of you traveled to my village. Yes, we did. You needed to see how your uncle's wife reacted. Immediately she set her eyes on me. She started confessing. <sighs> Sam told me all that happened. The death of my parents have been avenged. May she die the second death in that grave. Please, Stella, I want to thank you for standing for me to look after my brother. God will reward you. It's okay. You don't need to thank me. You see, destiny used it to bring me closer to Sam. And I'm grateful for that. <laughs> Enough of us, Mercy. So, how are you? You know it's been long. So when are you returning? Soon. I'll be running off with my car soon and I'll be back for good. What about Meso? Oh, Meso, she's fine. She's doing well. Mm -hmm. Mercy. If I forget, what about Kenneth? I hope he's taking care of you. Oh, please, forget about Kenneth. It's a topic of when I return. I have to go now. Take care <laughs> of yourself. Bye. Okay, bye. Who was that? That was Mercy, Sam's sister. Oh, Sam. Mm -hmm. So how is he? He's fine. Okay. Yes, Mom. All right, my dear. It's obvious to me that you love that young man very well. But there's something I want you to understand. You must be very, very careful. 
So that you won't regret it tomorrow. I won't regret it, Mom, because I love Sam so much. And I pray that someday he will walk. Okay, that's no problem. I pray so. Meet me at the city room. My son, I am proud of you that you did not disappoint us. Now that our debt has been avenged, we will rest in peace. Bring Stella home as your wife, for she is the angel of light. Through her, our debt was avenged. She possesses a power that no man can destroy until she is ready to give her virginity. back yet? No. Do you need anything? No, I'm fine. I'm fine. Is there anything I can do for you? What are you trying to do? What are, what are you doing? No! Stop that! What are you doing? You should be focused on getting back into school! Not this nonsense! I'm sorry. You're right. Please forgive my stupidity. Thank you. There's something special about this connection. What about but so much commitment? Something about me and you Like a magnetic fire But I cannot place it yeah. Just like sisters yeah. You're my bestie yeah. I wanna be with you every day yeah. There's something special About me and you And I call it a great bond, great bond. Between me and you You're like a sister And the bestie Great bond Existing between me and you, something unexplainable. Great bond, there is this connection, it's mysterious. So, yeah, I cannot let you go. Look at you! I'm so happy to see you. You look amazing. Thank you. Let, let, let me take my time and take a closer look at you. Ah, you did tell me. You did you too. Ah, this is beautiful. Ah, this felt like surprising you. Yes, it is. Teddy, yo, <laughs> my man. Sam! <laughs> oh my word! Yes, yes, yes. This has to be the greatest miracle ever. Yes, it is. It is. I am so, so grateful to God. This is amazing. Whoa. Totally amazing. <laughs> and I, I, now that we're all here, you know, everybody that matters to me, mm -hmm. I wanted to use this opportunity to thank you, especially for bringing mm. into my life mm. a guardian angel <laughs> someone whose presence has changed everything for good for me mm. and i also wanted you to witness this in person uh. stella 
Will you spend the rest of your life with me as my wife? Yes. Ah, <laughs> oh, this is beautiful. <laughs> ah, congratulations. Congratulations. <laughs> Ah, congratulations. <laughs> Welcome to the family. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> well, congratulations to the family. So. All right then. Um, Ken, why don't you yeah. do the honors? I <laughs> will do us the honors. <laughs> to a newly found mm. <laughs> next chapter in life. I hope by opening this, the newly found life, chapter of life, will be filled with so much blessings. <laughs> it will be. Okay, and this is also my own way of saying happy married life. Thank you, my savior. Mom, thank you. Mama Singh. <laughs> yes. How are you? I'm fine, Mama. I'm looking bad. Are you busy? Yeah, I'm busy, with my dear. Mom. So, yeah. I'm here to introduce you to Sam. You know, I've been talking about him all the yes, time, but you've not yes. seen him. Yes. And so he's here to see you. To see me? Mm hmm. Uh, but what do you stress him on coming on a wheelchair? <laughs> Don't worry. Babe? Eh? Babe? Oh, Jesus. Wonder shall never end. Good day, ma. Good day, my son. Sam? Ma. So you can walk? <laughs> yes, ma. It's a miracle. Hey! Okay. okay, let's go to the city room. Oh my god! Yeah, let's go. Ooh. What is life without someone's family members? Eh? Obaku finished me when she masterminded the death of my brother and paid me to start selling off his properties. Hey, 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 hey. Eh, true brother used to call me uncle and now see me as a name. I wish I could just close my eyes and never open them again. Oh. Are you all right? Have you called uh, your nephew, Sam? How can I call him? How can I call him? Uh, People that broke their hearts. People that used to see me as their uncle. Now they see me as an enemy. How can I call him? I'd rather die. Don't invite death to yourself with your own mouth. Ah. Where is your phone? Scenes of the past is coming to me. Something I did out of arrogance then. Oh, how can I face it? Open it. Oh, it's so shameful. How can I stand this? The smoke from the fire of yesterday has blinded my headway. How can I face it? Hello? Uh -huh. This is, this is, uh, Uncle Ozo. Yes, 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 yes. Um, please leave whatever you are doing right now and uh, come back home. As I speak with you right now, your uncle is dying. If it's better, you come back home and see things for yourself. Okay, okay. Thank you very much, my son. Thank you. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. um, Sam will come and take you to the hospital. Hmm? Sorry, Ndo? 
Ndo. Nothing will happen to you. Nothing. He should die for all I care. That man is very wicked. After everything they did to us, they don't even deserve anything good in this life. Mercy, you're right. You have every right to get angry. But see, you can't keep him away forever. He's your blood. Besides, your parents' death has been avenged. Mercy, I understand everything you're feeling right now. If you want to crucify him, you'll be justified too. But listen, God has been faithful. He's been fighting our battles and he will continue to fight for us. First thing tomorrow morning, we'll go and see him. Because we need to. Plus I will be declaring my intentions for Stella to him. And do not forget now that our parents are no more. He will be the one to stand in as father of the day. So just be calm, okay? I'm in support of mercy. He doesn't deserve pity. He should die for all I care. Things of the past is coming to me. Something I did out of arrogance then. Oh, how can I face it? Oh, it's so shameful. How can I stand this? The smoke from the fire of yesterday has blinded my headway. How can I face it? How long has it been like this? It has been like this for some time. Okay, you know what? There's no need. Let's hurry and get it. There's no need for that, Sam. He'll be healed right now. Swallow me. I'm ashamed of myself. I'm sorry. Please forgive me. Come up and up. Come just swallow me. Oh, if I can turn back the hands of time, I will right my wrongs. Soon. How did you do it? Uncle. Uzo. Uncle. Son. Did you know that one? <laughs> Uncle. Oh, sir. Where is Mercy? Mercy just got back from the state. She has one or two things to do. That's why she's not here. So. Thank you for coming around. That's not a problem. Sam, thank you for forgiving me even when I don't deserve forgiveness. Obako was evil. I did not know. I did not know. Thank you so much for forgiving me. Uncle, it's okay. We are, we are family. Okay? I wish you always stay together. Okay? Now what we'll do is we'll band together and move ahead. On to better things. It's okay. It's okay. Uh, in the spirit of a uh, good atmosphere, uh, I would like to formally introduce my wife-to-be. Uh, you know already, uh, Stella. Stella? Come, come. Come, my daughter. Hey. Thank you, sir. You're welcome. Thank you. Oh, 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 oh. Where are you from? What is your father's name? My father is late Mazi Omego from Umuze village. Oh, wow. From my in-laws, please. Yes, yes, yes. Oh, okay. <laughs> you're welcome. You're welcome, my daughter. Yes, welcome, eh? My son, so. I excuse you from them so I can find out from you why you chose uh, Stella over that girl that stood by you in the hospital. You mean Joy? <laughs> joy, Joy, yes. You know, the last time you came with this Stella, I, I wanted to ask you, but you know, other events took over. Oh, uncle. Joy. Joy. Women. I mean, I, I, I don't mean to generalize, but... Um, I'll just say it as it is. She she left me. Yes, uncle. She left me. 
And <laughs> she took one of my dad's cars. According to her, that is her compensation for the time she wasted on me. You don't mean it. <laughs> Joy. Anyway, it's good she revealed the type of person she is early enough. Instead of uh, going to become like uh, Obak, my late wife. Honestly, it's better. You know, the, the, the thing about women, they are like a package. If you are very lucky, when you untie your own, you find something good. <laughs> How can I atone for my sin towards you, my brother? Greed and wickedness occupied my mind and made me do things that are evil. What is life without love for humanity? You were an example of one. I wish you would forgive me, for I have seriously sinned against man and God. Ashamed of myself, I'm sorry. Please forgive me. Sam, you know you've been part of my story largely. And I want to seal our friendship by being part of your family. No, what are you on about? You're already a member of this family. Or what, you want to drop your surname for mine? Oh no. <laughs> what I mean by being part of your family is I I want to belong to your family, okay? Look, I love your sister, Mercy, and I want to marry her. I hear you. Is she aware that you are nursing this kind of feeling towards her? Oh wait, what, you're already farming on my land? Huh? Ken? Oh, no, no, no. We agree not to do any of such. <laughs> At least until both families agree. I was just, I was just messing around. You know, I don't like to hurt your feelings, right? No, it's okay. It's yeah. okay. Um, I love the idea. It's a good point. Um, uh, you have my support. Oh, wow. Mm -hmm. Thanks, bro. I really appreciate this. Now, why is he? Cheers to that. Oh, why not? To family. To family. Do my best thing. I wanna be with you every day. There's something special about me and you, and I call it a great bond. Oh, Ben. Hi. <laughs> I'm fine. How are you? I'm good. You look good. Mm, thank you. So, how have you been? Well, I've been good. Better than sticking with crippled Sam. Oh, really? Yes. <laughs> so, was that why you absconded with his dad's car? Absconded? <laughs> Please. I took it as a compensation for all I did for him. That's amazing. You took my father's car as compensation for what you did for me. Uh, that, that's interesting. Really interesting. Well, well yeah, take a good look at me. It's, um, I, I'm sorry for you that I didn't end up the way you, you know, thought I would. But um, anyway, it's no use wasting your time. I wish you all the best in life. Ben, yeah. let's leave. My shame of myself. I'm sorry. Please forgive me. Oh, if I can turn back the hands of time, I will right my wrongs. Sense of the past is coming to me. Something. What are you doing here? Hi, Messi. You've changed. Oh, yes. I've changed. Were you expecting me to remain the same after everything you've done? Anyway, that doesn't answer my question. What the hell are you doing in my house? Well, I am... I'm here to see Sam. I came mm. to apologize to him. 
to right the wrongs that I did to him. <laughs> what is she doing here? What is she looking for? She came to see Sam to apologize for all the pains she has cast him. Also for absconding with my father's car. She's right. I'm here to see Sam. I want to apologize. Mercy, I think you should let her sit and wait for Sam. Since she's here to correct her wrongs. If I can turn back the hands of time, I will right my wrongs. Since of the past is coming to me. Something I did out of arrogance then. Oh, how can I face it? Oh, it's so Be careful, Sam. Oh, no, I'm fine. days, the smoke from the fire of yesterday has blinded my head way. How can I face it? Oh, how can I stand it? Oh, What are you doing here? Sam, please calm down. At least she said she's here to correct her wrongs. Yeah, out. Here? Who? Look, what are you doing here? Joy, leave my house this minute if you don't want me to do something silly! No, 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 sir, chill. Oh, okay, calm down. Joy, I don't think this is the right time for you to be here, okay? You should, I think you should go, then come back in a week time. By right then, maybe it's already a bit at ease, okay? Okay. I'm going to take your advice. I'll be back in a week. Thank you. We are getting married in a week's time. Of course I know. And she will be invited as a guest to the wedding. <laughs> <laughs> Come on. Cheer up. Wow. <laughs> So. <laughs> oh boy. Yeah. Do not join me. Don't talk to me. It is your fault that Sam and I are not together. 
You told me, you convinced me to leave him. And after all these years, Sam looked me in the face and asked me what I was doing in his house. That shows how senseless you are. If you are matured enough, Joy, you should have stood your ground and proved your love. But no. When I met your father, my husband, my family refused that I would not marry him. But I married him because I know the word love. You have failed as a mother. When I brought in that guy into this house, what did you say? Eh? What? You started praising me, calling me all sort of good names. Eh, Oyirinea, Achalugo, Mwam. And now you sit there telling me that I'm senseless. Joy, calm down, please. Just calm down. Eh? We know how to settle it. Okay? Don't touch me! Don't! I don't want to die. I want to live. Somebody show me the way of life. I don't want to die. I want to live. Somebody help. Cause I'm losing my life. Yeah. In my mind, don't know what to do. Somebody Every day I'm going down, still no solution. Somebody hey, help, oh, I, somebody help, oh, I, somebody help me, somebody help me. Now I've lost my faith. And I'm still losing my mind I've run out of options And I don't know what to do I don't want to die Cause I want to leave mm. Somebody help me Somebody help me 